Hello, everybody. Welcome to Monster House. My name is Eddie Burback. I am the Blue Man Group. And I'm a house. And together, we make something. <laughs> It's the Halloween special, guys. It is, the it is Halloween. If you don't like, comment, or subscribe, I will come to your house in this blue man suit and stare through your window. I got the Microwave Society beans mug with some warm apple cider in it. I do not want to wear this anymore because it hurts my nose. Let's read some parents guide uh, reviews of this movie. Language, name calling, potty humor, terms of deity used as expletives, and other words such as suck <gasps> dude you can't say suck. moron <gasps> kiss my butt <laughs> all right let's get into this thing is that the eiffel tower i love how that's 2d and they just scaled it up i can't wait for the intro of this video to just be a jpeg i mean if my computer is still not working it might have to be hey it's the forced gump intro <laughs> Die. <laughs> Hello, Hello, piles of trash on the street. What was that? <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Is that gonna be a recurring bit now that we yell at movies to shut up? <laughs> Would the leaf really affect the bike that much? Yes. Is it made out of like leather? <laughs> Who opens their door like? <laughs> <laughs> Is this guy just gonna eat this child? Yes. Probably. That is bolted on. Not anymore. <laughs> I know for a fact most tricycles are made of like metal. That one's made out of like pencil lead. Why does this movie just love zooming in on stuff? They're like at 300 millimeters at all times. Thanks. October 30th. Another tricycle. Another one? This man is actively stealing tricycles. He's got like seven of them. And they're all broken apart the exact same way. You cannot stay up in your room all day staring at an old man through a telescope. Why, why not? That is completely fair. I hate that they've had this conversation before, apparently. I'm serious. What was that? I hate the animation so much in this movie. It's like really slow. I love that this house looks like it hasn't been tended to since like the 1800s, but is landscaping. The trees are all rowed up really well, his lawn looks great, but the house just... what? Why? It's the end of the movie, they just killed a kid. I'm okay. Just let me drive this thing, will you? This keeps going backwards, she just runs him over. <laughs> it's GTA now. Sorry, it's hard to see with the mask on. I can't see with this stupid mask. Ignore my Cleveland Brown shirt. <laughs> It's really hard to see with the mask on. Hi, DJ. Imagine, like, naming your child DJ. Like, what do you think he's gonna do? Be an electrical engineer. His name is probably, like, DJ Plumber, so he has one of two options in life. DJ Lawyer. <laughs> one day and three hours, it's candy time. It's candy time, guys. I'm on a diet, Josiah. Cool. Why is everything like so slow in this movie? Nothing has speed. This looks like a cutscene that isn't loading properly the entire time. <laughs> Three seconds on the clock. I'm playing basketball. <laughs> yeah. I'm playing basketball. Epic sentences. I'm recording a video. <laughs> 60 seconds to go. I'm recording a video. Except it's not 60 seconds to go. What it is to go is this ad. No. <laughs> <laughs> How would it bounce back directly into his face, though? It depends on how you hit it. If he hit it just straight on, it would just come back like that. Look, as someone who's played three basketball games in my life, <laughs> I've never seen that happen. Chowder, your ball just landed on Nebercracker's lawn. Nebercracker, what a dumb name. My name is Always Cookie. <laughs> my name is Sometimes Chip. I paid $28 for that ball. Why? It's so specific. But this was like 2000 what? Like seven? It was before inflation, so the ball was a little flat. What have you done? Just dodge it over here! Just, hey, get the ball! Run away! Don't worry about dying, just get the ball! Oh, don't worry. We'll have some dying here. You wanna be a dead person? No, I love life! <laughs> oh, he's lagging. Lagging, lagging. Hang on, he's pinging out. Oh, maybe he'll reconnect. Never cracker, try to restart Discord. Die. Literally. I was gonna get a paper cut from the grass. That wouldn't be a 
paper cut. Okay. Well, I wasn't gonna say a grass cut. That would just be a cut. I hate when I get a paper cut from a knife. Was it like possessed grass or something? Everything to the property line is possessed. Like as soon as it stops along the legal borders of the property, I guess it's not possessed anymore, but within that property line, it's haunted. He just gets hit by another car. <laughs> We've watched a kid get hit by a car and then a man have a heart attack. So, so far there have been two deaths. Well, he's still there, kind of. Let's call an emergency meeting. Dang it! Dead body report. Nevercracker isn't too sus. He's dead. The house looking kind of sus, though. I'm a murderer. Roll credits. That's the whole movie. He just kills an old man. DJ, I just saw an ambulance. Did I miss anything interesting? Hey, did anything cool happen? Like that old man dying? I wanted to see. I love how the police aren't there, like, investigating why he died or anything like that. He just died and a single ambulance came and that was it. DJ, why'd you break that? My question is how often does your 13 year old son pick up a pot and carry it five feet into the room and then drop it in the floor? I mean, they wouldn't know that. They just know that it's, I mean, yeah. Okay, yeah, why, why would it be broken there? I could maybe believe it if it was just broken where it was. Yeah, she didn't like knock it off. She carried it like five feet forward and was like, oh, oh no. Hey Jude, can you buy me a new motherboard? <laughs> Not again. You know how people dance, where they're like... You know how music sounds where it's just like screaming and then guitars, but it doesn't sound good? You ever just ACDC? Yeah, ACDC's isolated vocals are haunting. Why is that bed just solid rock? The blanket didn't even move. Nothing moved. This just rock. Hello? Every time I call Bren to wake him up, I roughly hear that sound. <sighs> Why do they pull their upper lip back so you can just see all their teeth at the same time? Just Like they look like clowns almost. It's weird. There's a line between being creepy and just making an ugly movie. <laughs> I'm on your lawn, Nevercracker. <laughs> I'm trespassing. Where did he go? Don't worry about it. They're putting luxury high-rises next to a subdivision. What is zoning? It's Indianapolis. <laughs> <laughs> Nevercracker's back from the dead. Nevercracker's back from the dead. <laughs> oh no! A bottle! Oh, so oh no! Down! <laughs> Come back, please! A bottle. Bottle. <laughs> bottle. <laughs> bottle. Give her his bottle. <laughs> bottle. <laughs> hey, Jude, Jude, bottle. I'm getting flashbacks to the Jonah video right now. <laughs> bottle. <laughs> this movie goes from really boring to that in like two seconds. Uh, guys, I think I get it. It's called Monster House. <laughs> Because the house is the monster. Yeah. Wow. The real monsters were the houses we met along the way. <laughs> Maybe you give me 20, I write a receipt for 30, and you pocket 10. Brendan, what if you give me 20, I give you 30, you give me 20 back, I give you 30, then you keep the 10, and I give you 20. And you get all the banana Laffy Taffies. You're fired. Oh, banana Laffy Taffies are like eating battery acid. No detectable movement. Why do you need a telescope to see the house that's right in front of you? <laughs> they just wanted to see it a little closer. It would be like me wearing binoculars to see my monitor. Don't go any further. There's literally a sign that says keep away like two feet to the left and she's like. Mm. <laughs> but I'm glad the house just has a built in function to shoot the sidewalk 80 feet in the air. What is the point of this? It's efficiency. Uh oh! <laughs> <laughs> All the other times someone has died, it's been like really dramatic, and then that time it's just like grab. I think it's time to call the police. Hey, police, uh, there's a house that the rug is grabbing people and sucking them inside the front door. We built a dummy. We filled the dummy with a few gallons of cold medicine. You can borrow from your dad's pharmacy. That's not, no, that's highly illegal. Yeah. Like, hey, hey can, can you give me a lot of cough syrup? Like a lot? Don't ask why, I just need it. I'm also gonna go to the store and buy a stupid amount of ibuprofen. I'm not making anything with this. I just need it. Are they just gonna shoplift? Yep. They're just gonna shoplift. 
Hey, look, they had a vacuum cleaner. This is a really stupid house. When three kids pull up in a, tr in a trash can and then there's a broom man with tire marks on his face, it's like, yeah, whatever. That's not how vacuums work. No, it's not. They don't just go forward. No. What- is this a self-propelled vacuum cleaner? What happens if you have to pull back over what you're doing? Does <laughs> it just keep going forward? It's just like- <laughs> <laughs> Where are the neighbors? Yeah, none of the next door neighbors are like, huh, that's weird. <laughs> well, just for any of this movie, where are the neighbors? Do they not hear the glass break and the screaming children in the car? The house knows that we're in here. Bed thinks we're still in the car. Better talk and shine a light. Wow, it doesn't think we're in here. Let's talk very loud. I don't think the house knows we're in here. I think we're good. I don't think it knows, guys. Use your indoor voices, Brandon. No. <gasps> Explosives. Why does that house just have bombs in it? Just in case. Did you take note of who that owner was? It was Deep Buscemi is like an 80-year-old angry man who's having heart attacks on his lawn and breaking tricycles. What? I'm not surprised he has a bomb in his living room. Constance, the giant Tess. See, maybe if you didn't zoom in, like, right into each individual letter, I could have read that myself. Our whole body is buried in cement. Actually, that's concrete. Cement is a powder that goes into concrete. Listen. I will argue about this all day long. If she's buried in powder, she is, but cement is not the same thing as concrete. Stop saying it's a cement mixer because that means it's dust spinning. Bye. Another great idea, DJ. They're alive. He got you out of the house that was trying to eat you and you're mad. Why was he driving the ambulance? Does the movie explain it? No. No, did he just break out of the hospital and he was fine? I can take you away from here. Now it's not much I know, but just- <gasps> I want just the up intro for this couple. Show how she dies and everything and how he becomes the man he is. That's basically what this is. Yeah, but instead of flying off in the house, the house is alive. Yeah, this is the alternate ending. This is down. <laughs> Oh look, the cement mixer dumped over her. <sighs> so, I finished the house. You just built your house around your dead wife? Instead of burying her? There was no funeral, you just kept going. Beware. <laughs> but my name is Josiah, not where. She attacks anyone who comes near. I'm assuming it's supposed to be like the ghost of Constance. Yeah. Since when do ghosts just make the entire house alive. I would assume being that she was buried within the house as it was being constructed, they were breaking ground here, Josiah, and then nobody ever followed up on what they broke ground on. They literally were breaking the ground because the ground moves in this movie. Wow, Jude, you made a really good observation there. Come on, instead of like trying to get away, let's go to the big hole so we can have the final showdown of the movie. Yep, it's the boss fight. You've hurt people. You've killed people, actually. You've been actively murdering children. Oh, Constance. Can't do that. No, don't. Stop. Jimmy, this is too hard. You know, they could just throw it into the furnace that's actively on fire and it would probably explode. Oh, are they gonna do the trope where he can't light it? Yeah, what do you think they're gonna do? Come on, it's a kid's movie. Yeah, but he's gonna throw it into a fire. <laughs> oh no, it's a Lego game and you're holding X. <laughs> hey look, it's one of these crane climbing YouTubers. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ali <Allie> Law. It's <laughs> climbing cranes in Dubai, part 50. And they just like get arrested in every video somehow. <laughs> and their punishment is always that they can't climb in Dubai anymore. And then they do. The crane like downtown and they get caught again and they're just like, you guys better not be climbing again. <laughs> if I see you climbing one more time, hey, hey, are you climbing? <laughs> I'm gonna count to three. And if you're not down here by the time I'm done counting, I'm gonna tell you not to climb again. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, you're not coming down. <laughs> I swear that is how they handle that. It's the worst. I give this movie a solid five out of ten. I give it. <laughs> if 
If you like this video, follow us on Twitch because our Twitch streams are exactly like our videos. Yep, they're the same thing, same pacing, exactly the same. Leave a like and uh, go follow us on Twitter and Twitch and join our Discord link in the description. Thank y'all for watching and uh, I'm playing basketball.